Clock in, clock in. Black got to do out there. Yeah. yeah. That he already dead. It ain't no need to check his vitals, bitch. Yeah. He already dead. It ain't no need to check his vitals. Like I got to stand up, man. Yo. Uh, let me get a hundred thousand likes. Nothing too special. Just a hundred. I'm already knowing y'all seen the video I just did, man. With Quando Rondo letting me know he can't trust nobody. He feel like, you feel me? He been getting backdoed, all type of situations. And in all honesty, bro, like instead of people saluting him for uh, doing a positive situation, you know, we already was looking forward for people to, you know, bash his name and, and calling him this and that. But a person that we didn't expect to say something, I didn't expect to say something, was like somebody close to uh, Nipsey Hussle, and he ended up saying, you can't drop your flag and say you're not NH no more. Nigga, go to the hood and get your put off. Don't cry now. We lose homies all the time. Not everybody gonna ride. You was a goofy internet banger anyways. It's like, damn. This is why he don't want to be a part no more. Like, instead of somebody older or whatever, you feel me, with more experience coming to him and letting him know and embracing him like, fam, this how it is. You feel me? You shouldn't let that break you. You niggas is clowning him. Why the hell would he want to be a part? You feel what I'm saying? The nigga feeling like his life in danger and, and, and nobody is backing him. The people who supposed to be backing him is clicking up with the people who not backing him. The people who trying to get at him. What the hell? He feeling like loyalty lost. Now, by him saying he should go back to the hood and get his put off, apparently that means go back to the hood and fight or whatever. Now, how in the hell is that going to turn out? Especially if Lil' Tim now. When are you niggas liable to get hit up, fam? You feel what I'm saying? Or hell, he shouldn't even trust that. Shit, I wouldn't trust it. Nigga, you see me when you see me, and I ain't hiding neither. You feel what I'm saying? But it's like, damn, how could he feel like he should stay a part of something that's basically clowning him and rejecting him, you feel me? And that shit is just, it, it just look awkward, you feel me? And somebody else who decided to say something, which is Fulio, bro. And he said, dog, homeboy dead in Cali. He trying to squash beef and throw his flag, and it's too late for that, nephew. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Fulio done the lame as hell, bro. Like, you be doing some weird ass shit, bro. Like, you pop out in the most awkward situations, fam. Like, when J.D. Young get passed, you popped out and said something. Like, Fulio is not putting in no type of work, but he quick to speak on every single situation that pop off with people he don't like. Nigga, you weird as hell, fam. You be clowning the most awkward situations ever, bro. It's people that real dead got issues with him that's not saying nothing. But your weird computer hanging ass is, is ready to say something negative about a bad situation, fam. Bro, you is built like a little pencil, fam. Like, you the most weirdest caterpillar I ever seen, fam. Like, real talk, bro. Nigga always got some off the wall stuff to say at the wrong moment. Nigga, you worse than me. So what the hell wrong with Fulio, bro? Acting like you ain't lied about how many shots were shot at you, fam. Talking about shell scraping your ankles and all. Nigga, you fell on the sidewalk. Nigga, you, you hit the curb. Talking about you got scraped. Fam, you be out here lying about your situation, but you quit to run and talk about the next person's situation at the wrong moment at that, fam. Hell wrong with that boy, y'all. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this in the comment below. I'm about doing that. Clock out, clock out, black out. Tell you what now.